my god. I'm about to have a heat stroke. It's so hot. Hey pretty people, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome to my channel. Make sure that you're subscribed so that you can join all the fun. So today, these bugs are flying outside. Ugh. So I've gotten some questions about what I bring to a casting, what I keep handy, what I keep ready. So today I'm gonna be showing you guys what I keep in my model bag. So with this bag, I like to keep it ready at all times because you never know when you're gonna be called for something and you just always wanna be prepared. So let me show you what my model bag looks like. This is her, she's a little backpack. It's really handy and it has different pockets for different things so it's really easy to stay organized and ready with this. And my last model bag, which I have here, is this big old thing and it was really cute, really chic at the time but all it is is just one big zipper and there's not really any pockets or anything so I kind of wanted to transition into something that I could really stay organized with instead of just tossing everything into a very large oversized bag. That thing when I used to take it was really big and obnoxious so moving on to something a little bit smaller and practical. So let me go through the pockets one by one and let's just show you everything that I got going on in here. So the big one doesn't have that much actually. I kind of like to keep it a little light. I don't want to break my back, you know, when I'm going and doing things. So I like to keep it minimally packed. First things first, water. Always gotta have my water handy. Hello, summertime, water, you need it. Speaking of water, I need some right now. Thirsty. <laughs> so next I got my wallet and it's very tiny and I like to have a small wallet because I tend to carry smaller purses. So this little thing can go from a small bag to a big bag. I fit in any size bag so it's perfect. Let me not show my cards. Okay, let me not do that. <laughs> next in here I got some Dove Dry Invisible Spray. Nothing is worse than going into a casting, going into a job, going anywhere, honestly, with deodorant stains all over your outfit. <sighs> and I've been there. I am a deodorant prone bitch, so I have to do these hand deodorants. And I don't like them, I hate them. They make you so dry and like, feel like a desert under your arms, but it's what you have to do to look nice and presentable, so. But when I get in the car, you know, I got my stick ready and I'm like <laughs> putting it on because I hate the dry sprays. <sighs> and also I like to keep my iPad in there as well because this has my portfolio on it, which is basically all my images. And it's a way that clients really judge you and judge if you're right for that booking. So you don't wanna go anywhere without your portfolio. And in my case, without my iPad. So yeah, I keep that ready and I keep it charged up so that whenever I'm called, I'm just good to go. And this one is kind of old. It's like an iPad mini. I got it so many years ago, I don't even remember, and it loads so slowly, so I like to get my portfolio up, get it all ready and loaded before I go in, because I've sat through a casting where I tried to get it up, it wouldn't load, it was just not, not good. So I learned from that experience, and now I'm ready, right before I go in. Next, I got this little thing. This is a mini, what are they called, lint removers. I'm making lint appear right now, because I like to wrap them in paper, Toilet paper, that's the word, paper. But I like to wrap these in toilet paper so that it doesn't stick to everything because been there, done that, and not fun. You always need lint removers in a tight situation where it's like very last minute, right as you're about to go in, so the last thing you want is to be tearing it off and having it sticking to other things in your bag. So I like to keep this wrapped up and tucked away in a different section than everything else. So that is it for the big part. Nothing more to see in there. She's cleared yeah. out. Let's go into the next little section right here, which is very boring. It's just my comp card and, well comp cards, plural, and my release forms. I just keep them handy. You never know when you're gonna get called and you never know when you're gonna have a job. So having both just really ready and available is good. And I keep them separate for obvious reasons because I just want it to be quick and handy when I'm with the client. So that's that. Next in this little section right here, I have a lot. A lot of little things. Number one, a pen. Never know when you're gonna have to sign your name, sign your release form, whatever it is. You'll be happy that you have it because when you don't have it is when you need it and then when you have it is when you don't need it. So you may as well just have it. Just cause. Ooh, 
So I didn't mean to kick the thing there. I'm like trying a new setup here. Off to a great start already. Kick in my stuff. It's like so off, okay. I think that's good, I don't know, whatever. Moving on, I have a lotion in my bag. No one wants to be ashy going in and seeing a client, so not much to say, just stay hydrated and moisturized because that's important. Oh my God, I need like a fan in here. I need one of those like fans. I think that's next to be added because that would be so nice during the summer when it's scorching hot. <laughs> so next, I have a little bit of a weird combo, but it's practical and it's needed, so that's why I have it. And the first is a little thing of toothpaste. You never know when you're gonna need to just touch up your teeth. You know, when you don't have it, like I said with the pen, is when you'll need it. So just carry it because then you won't need it. And next, I got these little flossers. I don't know, I think my dentist gave it to me. <gasps> Wait, there's none in here. Okay, well I got an empty pack of flossers, so I got a coupon too, girl, okay. So that isn't what I expected, but I normally have little flossers that are really easy to floss your teeth real quick. Next, I have some hair ties in different colors. I guess depending on what I'm wearing that day will determine which one I put on. I'm ready. And next, <laughs> I have eye drops. Little, mini, individual, disposable, individual use. So many words going into describing this, but just one time use eye drops that I've learned from experience that I need. So I'm a contact wearer and when you're on set and a photographer is using a fan and it's blowing your way for a long period of time, your contacts really, really dry up. It's so uncomfortable and horrible. And if you shoot on a beach and you have contacts, definitely have eye drops because the first time I shot on a beach, I don't know how this happened, but I got sand granules underneath my contacts. It was horrible and so uncomfortable. My eyes were like bloodshot. Obviously I didn't get cute pics because <laughs> that's obvious. And I just really needed these. So after that shoot, I ran out and got eye drops so that I don't have that problem ever again. Next, I keep a pair of little clippers. I'm prone to little hangnails. So I keep these handy and keep myself ready because hangnails, and little gross nails are not cute, especially when you're shooting or wanting to impress a client, so <laughs> I keep that ready. Next, I have some gum. No explanation needed. You wanna have some fresh breath. Next, I keep some Carmex ready, and if you know me in real life, you know that this is my go-to. It is my thing that I keep with me 24-7. If you catch me without Carmex, or if I have another kind of chopstick in my hand, like you know I'm having an off day, something's wrong, and I'm probably not in a good mood, so, you know. I keep my Carmex ready with me at all times, and of course, I'm gonna have it in my model bag. So that's it in the little section. Nothing more to see there, and now let's move on to this big one right here. So up here, I keep some oil blotting sheets, which I need right now because I'm sweating. I'm like, getting all oily, so I need some of this right now, but in the summer, even in the spring, you can get oily and gross, so this just helps you stay cute, matte, and looking good. And next, I keep a whole CVS Pharmacy worth of tampons with me, <laughs> because Lord knows when that's gonna just pop on and start, so of course, they're gonna go in my model bag because when that happens and you're not prepared, nothing's worse. Mother Nature could strike at any time, so I just like to stay prepared. And lastly, I like to keep a pair of sunglasses that I wear to castings, to jobs, whatever it may be. I like these ones. I've worn these for the longest time because they are very cute very stylish and they don't really leave marks on my nose where my makeup is which is very important to me that just made me look a little bit of a hot mess but whatever i have other glasses that just really make me have two huge round circles where they were and nobody wants to have their makeup look like that so keep my favorite pair of sunglasses with me and i'm good so that was everything that i like to keep handy and ready there we go, and my model bag. I love this bag, it's my travel bag, my model bag, it's my all around essential bag for literally anything. So yeah, that's what I like to keep in her and what I like to keep ready. So that is it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing this video and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.